basic principle behind liquid cooling in smartphone work on the dissipation of heat. The cooling system consists of a heat pipe with a liquid inside. This liquid becomes vapor by absorbing heat from the chipset. The heat is further dissipated and the ambient temperature is maintained. In phones, you use a copper thermal heat pipe to distribute the heat and move it away from the CPU. This kicks into play when the phone is performing high-intensity tasks. This may include tasks like gaming or even media playback. The copper tube has a very minuscule amount of liquid and this liquid is not even enough to see if the tube is cut off. As the processor heats up, the liquid heats up and turns into vapor, thus observing the heat from the CPU. This vapor then moves to the opposite end of the heat pipe. This end is farther away from the CPU and is considerably cooler. The vapor dissipates the heat, thus turning back into liquid form. This process is continuous and works well to dissipate and disperse heat from a concentrated area to much larger area, thus cooling the entire system faster and more efficiently.